so far I have my materials, my element properties. Next, I'm going to create the mesh. Um, before I do the uh, the mesh geometry, I'm first going to do a mesh control to make sure that I have an adequate mesh size um, for my purposes. So I'm going to do a size on solid, and I'm going to choose that one there. And I have two options. One's the, the tetrahedral or uh, four-sided type elements, or I could choose my hex um, hex elements or brick shape type elements. For this one, I'm going to choose my hex mesh. You can see the little dots or mesh seeds telling me um, how large uh, a particular element edge length would be. I'm going to say that's particular that's uh, pretty sufficient for this, so I'm going to say mesh geometry hex mesh solid. I'm going to try to mesh the aluminum tube a little bit finer because I'm more interested in the stresses than that. So again, I'm going to do a mesh control size on surface, and then I'm going to do a pick box. And I'm going to set the mesh size for the tube to be about 0.3 inches. That looks pretty good. Let's go ahead and do the mesh geometry surface. Previous. And that's going to be mesh with my plate property.